A photo of a man wearing a KKK hood at an East County grocery store has gone viral. Take a look. The man was spotted wearing the hood while shopping at the Vons in Santee over the weekend. As you can imagine, many people pretty upset by this. News 8's Chris Grove live in Santee this morning. Chris, how is the grocery store responding and what did the mayor have to say about this? Yeah, so Vaughn's put out a statement that we'll get to a little bit later, but it's all on our website on CBS8.com where they denounce the actions of this person and praise their employees for doing the right thing. Similar sentiments shared by the mayor of Santee that essentially this is not representative of Santee or San Diego County at large and that this individual was wrong for doing this. Now let's show you what that looks like when this person uh, that we still don't know the identity of walked into this Vaughn's here on Mission Gorge Road with that clan hood on his face. You can see him casually pushing that cart around the store multiple times caught with that clan uh, hood on his face as well as dressed in that camo shirt and shorts. Now, we're told by the person who took some of the pictures that when he saw this man, he was sick to his stomach. We saw a number of reactions on social media that were similar, and it was also a sentiment shared by Santee Mayor John Minto. And he told us that he did not uh, think very highly of this person. He was very critical of him, but he did have compliments again for the employees and shoppers that decided to do something when they saw this guy. They saw this and they took action. They notified the management of Vons and they took action. They made that guy remove that mask. I'm glad they did. And back to that statement from Vons, you can see it right here. It reads in part, quote, unfortunately, an alarming and isolated incident occurred at our Vons store in CNT where a customer chose an inflammatory method of wearing a face covering. Needless to say, it was shocking. Several members of our team asked the customer to remove it and all requests were ignored until the customer was in the checkout area. This was a disturbing incident for our associates and customers and we are reviewing with our team how to best handle such inappropriate situations in the future. Now, we did reach out to the sheriff's department about this incident. They said they were not called to the Vaughn store that Saturday when this happened, but they have been made aware of this and they are looking into it uh, while also denouncing the actions taken by this man.